it's kind of a combination of different musics and different moments. Because one could say also that the point about these, these kind of moments is that once they've been heard, everything has changed. You can't go backwards. And uh, I suppose this is both personally, but also effectively professionally, and in one's life, once something has been heard and that taste of wow, something can be that fantastic. It's committed. You're, you have to try. You have to, you have to go on. You have to try and find that same thing for yourself. They, they definitely were just very special in the way they recorded their, their equipment. Even though it was, it was maybe not as advanced as it was as it is now. But, but EMI they had their own sound, just like Motown did, and that came in the equipment. You know, and, uh, EMI uh, had some board specially designed for EMI. They, they were actually geniuses in the studio. Even last night, we were kind of listening to the stuff and running down the songs, and I heard stuff I never heard before. Exactly how cool the drums sounded and how they did it. And it's always amazing to me. I've never listened to any Beatles song and thought, ah, I've heard that. I know that one inside and out, because there's always a, a, another level, another great idea that, that's, that's there. After this, the rules have changed. Actually, a lot of gates were open in terms of the possibilities for music of all kinds. And I think the ripples from this actually went out into almost every other form of music as well. <laughs>